last night, night before last. Philippines is the oldest. What a climb. Oh, some boys in the middle of the road up here. They even give us boys. The boys is coming to you. Get out the way. Get out the Red, way. Yeah. <laughs> something happened to it. Back wheel's not turning or something. Chain locked or something. Locked yeah. Man, I'm impressed with all the work they've done back in here. I mean, they have spent some money to do all this. There's a dead end here. Yeah. Yeah. That's bad. Side of that cliff just a second ago. Steadily on a climb. I needed this vacation. This adventure. Vacation. Man, this all worked out great. That is funny. We're wearing red, white, and blue. Oh, you're looking at <laughs> Representing. Oh, yeah, the Philippines. <laughs> yeah, Philippines. Right, We're Americans. Y'all yeah. got gold in yours. Oh, you're, yeah, you're, you're gold. Yeah, you're like blue. Are you really and you're thinking white? Philippines. I'm talking about us being Americans. Red, red, red white, and blue. And blue. Texas, uh, yeah, it's Texas colors too. Yeah, the the United States and Texas. Wow. Woo. Man, it just gets higher and higher. Yeah. Well, they're doing the construction in here. Oh, it stops. Yeah, that's what yeah. you said. <laughs> then it comes to a stop. <laughs> I just want to get out. Wow, it's raining now. Well, the road ends right there in front of us. End of the line, boys. <laughs> so they're trying to extend the it on up in there. It's white. That's all the way down. What you see right there, that blue, is the ocean. Is that our house sticking up right there? Joke. But that is all the way back down. To the coast there's actually a ship out in the water there right now if it, if it was just a little clear right in the middle of the screen there it is there's a ship out there on the ocean right there boy it's camera can zoom that is a long ways away this thing really shocks me how well it can zoom so yeah that is the coastline down there and this is the mountains that we see from our house from the beach down there back up looking the other way Well, the tile's looking very nice, man. Check this all out. It's looking good. Crew's on break right now. 
So he's got all of that and got all of this done up here, right in front of this third floor room. And now he's heading across over here where this veranda sticks out over the other veranda above our dirty kitchen and all outside right there. So it's looking pretty darn cool. But man, it's awesome. It feels good to stand on. And, uh, we didn't pour it perfect when we poured it before because we knew we were going to tile over it. So um, it had like a pool of water over here in this one. And I was so tired of that little pool of water was always sweeping it out. It's looking really cool though. So I'll show you guys the project going on over here. And what's happening right here is we are building up for a sliding patio door right there. We've had one more of these sliding patio doors. These are made out of that uh, UPVC, that just like the ones on all the rest of the house. And we've had it stored in a spare bedroom that we haven't textured or painted that bedroom yet. We need to get everything out of it. And it was time now with tiling go on to put that door in over here. So that's exactly what's happening here. They're forming up and then they will be pouring in the concrete on it. And we'll have a sliding glass door here. And then the tiles will come right up here at that at one level. And then out, this will be going then outdoors right here and the tiles here will be another level and there's a drain down over there that has a drain pipe that drains down over at the next balcony below and that pipe goes into the storm system for the subdivision here so pretty darn cool man it's all happening um to be honest i had a plan to put a door here and then i thought maybe i wouldn't but blowing rains can limit our use of this space up here and I wanted it where I could close that right there I did I want it where I could close this that was my original design anyway that's why the roof and the gutter stops right there and that's all why it's set up like this with columns so it'll be a nice sliding glass door a uh, little area set out there like a little lanai you know and it's gonna be pretty all tiled there and we can put some plants and things and stuff and give it a really cozy little feel some seating out there maybe built out some native wood in here I'm planning to have a glass company to come and put me sliding windows into these spots right here that one that one and that one those three spots I plan on putting sliding windows yeah right across there um, that's I think that's gonna be really cool it'll probably be in three sections and maybe where you can slide two sections all the way back over the one it gives you some nice big open space for days that you want to let the air blow but if it's a rainy day uh, storms in the area whatever well then you can close them up now we don't get like super direct hits from typhoons here. Now, I'm not saying that we don't take some hard winds, but the typhoons arrive in the Philippines from over on the west side, coming across to the east side. And by the time they get over here to us, from the direction they usually come towards us here, uh, they've already hit several different chains of islands, you know, like for instance, Cebu, um, and across maybe over parts of Negros, or they've hit across over towards Tacloban and all of that area back across over there, and they're making their way over here, and they've they've weakened down from hitting mountains at that point. Now, sometimes after they get past us here, and they've been weakened down a little bit they'll still be like a strong tropical storm but after they move back out on these open waters sometimes it'll regain strength going out towards palawan and out those directions so um, we don't get that super super mega destructive winds but now we do get waves and surf though and of course we get un unadulterated winds because these open waters there's nothing blocks it so this is the south 
and this is the west and we do get a southwest monsoon and that's what's breezing in here right now is that southwest monsoon and uh it's a kind of a steady wind that'll blow with that but it will blow in all down that side right there but if any of you asking about you know hurricane shutters and all that look there's no houses down through here anywhere that's ever needed that um it just hasn't we don't take that direct hit like the other side of the island does now i say island not this island the other side of the island chain We're going out towards the pacific side so anyway that's a little story with that up here where you see that's still open i'm gonna put some um like skylight panels right up there letting light come through right in the middle right over that staircase and brighten all this area up right here and i think that is going to be very nice and i already got flashing everything for it and i'll be doing that myself that'll be happening here pretty soon as well and then as joel comes around tiling all of this area we'll work our way up that staircase right there and eventually the upper deck this is going to make a wonderful great room up here but if we have hard blowing rain it's still going to come in some but not massively bad as it could because this will still be open right here and the thing is at least there's a eight foot overhang out right there and then there's this little half wall with a bar top that will block some of that blowing rain coming across. But we still do have enough open air in here that it can receive moisture back up in here. Well, check this out, man. It is blowing rain hard. Ooh, can you open that door? It's blowing it so hard right there. That is some rain. Yeah, that's some rain. Go check out and see what the wind generator's doing. I don't know if it's enough straight wind. Let's go see. Definitely a good hard rain. Well, I got up here and it was too late for that. The wind's really slowed down now. It's just a breeze. And that initial wave of rain to hit pass by man look at this tile work up here this is so nice very very nice i'm happy to see this hoping it's not leaving no low places to hold water hopefully hopefully it all drains away be easy to squeegee away Hopefully so. These are pretty good swells out there right now. I was gonna show the wind generator up there working, but it's so funny how the camera puts it in slow motion and that thing's up there hauling butt, going the opposite direction. It's just the way that the uh, camera catches the frames. It's just an illusion, like you see that. That's just all an illusion. In reality, it is hauling butt one direction. Isn't that funny? That is so funny. So uh, it is definitely putting some power out up there today. I know you don't see it because the way the camera is catching it. It'll even look like it's going in reverse, Bill. It'll come to even like, a, it'll look like it's at a standstill and even like it's going the other direction. Just watch. See, it's even going backwards. Oh, wow. It's how what is in real. Look, 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 now it comes to a standstill. Yeah, isn't it's that crazy? So fast. Yeah, isn't yeah. that funny how it catches that and does that illusion it, like that? It is spinning so fast you can hardly even see the blade. Yeah. <laughs>